early, I don't know, vlogmas, day two, cheers, morning coffee. Um, also, I kind of already ate my chocolate for day two. And whilst making my coffee, I'm sorry, I cheated. <laughs> I got this little guy. He's very cute. The chocolate's the same as the picture, if you didn't know. We have a slight problem. And from today, face masks are mandatory once again in England on public transport and in shops. Instead of making it Christmas advent calendars today, which is what I did have planned, I thought I'd use that fabric to try and make a face mask. Now here's the thing, <clears throat> I've never actually made one before. <laughs> and um, yeah, I found a like pattern to use online. So I figured I'd just follow it. How hard can it be, right? Mm. Oh my God, this is so good. It's pumpkin flavor from October still. Oh, so nice. I love the pumpkin syrup. If you are Swedish and you've ever had the pumpkin latte from Nespresso House, that's what this is. It's the exact same syrup. It's so good. <laughs> oh. oh yeah. Except the coffee is actually Starbucks coffee. So technically it's not quite the same, but anyway. So that's the plan for today. I am gonna go get showered, get ready. <coughs> um, maybe I'll wake up a little bit, maybe not. We'll see, I hope so, because I don't want to sew my fingers to a face mask. Okay, I've done my test run and it's a little sad. <laughs> How hard can it be, right? Oh my god, it was horrible. Everything kept getting like stuck in my machine and yeah, it it did not it did not come out well. This pattern, like the elastic go right at the bottom, which doesn't really make a huge amount of sense to me because it's only gonna be holding it from like here and the bottom is just gonna be like flappy. That doesn't really make any sense. How hard can it be, right? Houston, we have a problem. <laughs> I was like, what am I doing? I'll just use my already existing mask as a template and recreate it. I'm so silly. Except now the need for this mask to work has just escalated dr drastically because I can't find my original mask. I'm just gonna try and make a pattern myself, which is never a good idea and never works for me, but you know, Desperate times, desperate measures. <laughs> okay, I'm having a little guesstimate. Uh, I'm thinking like, I, I don't know, honestly, I don't know. Shouldn't it be like rounder? Oh my God, I'm an actual moron. I've sewn it wrong wrong side to right side. Oh my god. How hard can it be, right? <laughs> Typical. Typical. Okay, so I'm gonna have to unpick this now. <laughs> god, it's tiny again. It's fucking tiny. How do I keep making child size ones? There we go. It kind of worked. We're getting there. We're, we're learning. It's gonna take us all bloody day to make one face mask, but... We get, we're getting there. So I'm gonna fold the fabric over and basically try to do this shape again, but a lot bigger. <laughs> Since this definitely worked, I'm thinking like, cause the thing is it did come to like here. By the time I like sewed it all together, there wasn't enough, it wasn't big enough. So maybe, Please say this works. <laughs> Which way round was I meant to do it? Wait. Oh my god, I think I've sewn this the wrong way, haven't I? Yeah, I have. I should have sewn it the other way around. Oh my god, no. <laughs> uh, we have at least firmly established one thing and that is that this channel will never become an arts and crafts channel. <laughs> Please be right now. Please be right. <laughs> um, do 
yeah, it's actually a little bit better. There's a bit of shape around my nose. It's okay, but the bottom is too big. I need to lose a bit of fabric at the bottom. I think YOLO is the only way to describe this face mask. But yeah, know what? It kind of worked. It's a little bit too big still. My God. It's very big. I did not think it was gonna be this big. I mean, I like it being big because then I can put my glasses on top and my glasses don't get steamed up. So that's good. Maybe it's just the shape. I don't know. I feel like it could be like way smaller still. <laughs> I'm committing, I'm 100% committing to just cutting off all of this excess. No measurements. <laughs> Never follow a tutorial from me, <laughs> ever. <laughs> My God, she's done it. Ah, did it. <laughs> Yay, go <got> me. <laughs> I actually managed to make one. It's catastrophic looking. <laughs> Oh my god, this looks absolutely shit. <laughs> oh god. Yeah. But you know what? We did it. <laughs> and it's actually going to be reversible. I think I might try and make another one though. My camera battery died. So, you missed the making of my most successful mask yet. I ran out of uh, elastic stuff. It was like also really bad. It was like pulling apart. So one has elastic and this one has, I just, I just made some little thingies out of the same material as you can see. And it works fine. I need to tidy it up because I still have some loose threads as you can see there's like a bit of loose threads. Uh, so it's not super tidy yet, but yeah, you got me. <laughs> I'm really happy with this one. It just came out well. I don't know. I'm gonna try and replicate it with the cute teddy bear fabric. My desk is an absolute mess. Come look at my desk. Oh my goodness. New fabric. The tiny area that I have been working with. <laughs> It's just like nap or room for anything, really. Okay, the straps are too big. Fuck. <laughs> well, looks like I'm unpicking everything. Which one's your favorite? This one's my favorite, definitely. I think it fits the best and it looks the best. Thank you so, so much for watching all the way to the end. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Bye.